Hello and welcome back to Time Out Quick Guides. Today we're talking about the best afternoon teas in Dubai, crowned by the Time Out Dubai Restaurant Awards 2019. But before we get going, don't forget to subscribe to the Time Out GCC YouTube channel. There's a button just down there. Click it. We've got loads more videos just like this, and there are some awesome prizes that you can get your hands on every single month. But let's get going. So today we're going to be starting at Al Bayt in the Palace downtown. Yes, over at downtown Dubai's luxurious hotel, you can choose from a traditional English or Arabic afternoon tea in the Arabesque lobby. The Arabic tray offers shawarma and kofta concoctions, scones flavoured with saffron and cardamom, and camel milk creme brulee. Mm. Mm. I know, right? Mm. It costs 170 dirhams per person and is available every single day of the week. Next up today, we're heading to Al Firuz Lounge. Yes, this is where you can indulge in a traditional English tea in an elegant lounge with views of Dubai's iconic Burj Al Arab Jumeirah. As you'd hope, you'll find classics such as Victoria sponge, English fruitcake, tea cake sandwiches, and a whole bunch more. You'll find it at Jumeirah Al Qasr, costing 233 dirhams per person, and it's available daily from 2 p.m. until 5 p.m. For our third entry, where else would you want to enjoy the grand tradition of afternoon tea than the Burj Khalifa's atmosphere. You'll be able to get three delectable high tea options mm. in the world's tallest restaurant. Flavours include berries, cream and savoury treats or fine roasts with seasonal vegetables. Mm. Meanwhile, for dessert, you can expect pastries and traditional favourites and of course, the views are among the best around. This will set you back 430 dirhams for a non-window table and 503 dirhams for a window table with all those views included, yeah. of course. It's all about those views. Next up today is Pearl Lounge. Yes, absolutely. Another place with stunning views, this time of the Burj Al Arab. This afternoon tea at the Jumeirah Beach Hotel offers up gourmet treats like tartines, sandwiches, and fresh quiches as you sip on some exquisite fresh, loose tea and coffee. It will set you back 190 dirhams per person and you'll get it every single day. Alternatively, you can head into the Burj Al Arab to Sana Dar. Now what you'll find at one of Dubai's most iconic landmarks is a classic afternoon tea. Everything from delicate sandwiches, fresh pastries and cakes, making it an offering you have to try at least once. Mm -hmm. Now it doesn't come cheap at 550 dirhams per person, but it is a top experience. Next, it's over to Shy Salon. And this is where you can marvel at the ornate ceilings as you enjoy a selection of English style finger foods. We're talking cakes, snacks, and a whole bunch more. And it complements the wide range of Jing loose leaf teas they have available. You'll find this open every single day at the Four Seasons Resort Dubai at Jumeirah Beach, and it will set you back 270 dirhams per person. The final afternoon tea on the shortlist is the lounge at the address downtown. At this afternoon tea in downtown Dubai, you can relax and rejuvenate with the finest selection of gourmet delicacies, tea and coffee in the heart of a hotel where floor to ceiling windows provide a perfectly framed view of the Burj. Now, what could be better than that? Not much. It costs 150 dirhams a person and is available every single day. And now we're on to the highly commended and the first up is Raffles Salon. Amid a warm and homely setting, this is an excellent place to relax and indulge in some beautiful culinary creations that go beyond what is traditionally served at an afternoon tea. Highlights include rose-shaped brie mousse with fig compote and hibiscus cured salmon, now that's fancy, mm. and nothing is too much trouble for the staff who are more than happy to help. This comes in at 290 dirhams for two people, daily from 2pm until 7pm, and you'll find it at Raffles Dubai in Oud Mehta. The second highly commended winner is the Sidra Lounge at Habtor Palace. Now, the opulent surroundings of Sidra Lounge are perhaps the ultimate place to experience the grand age-old tradition of afternoon tea. Guests are serenaded by the live sounds of a pianist, cellist, and saxophonist while enjoying three courses of delicious cakes and sandwiches. There's also a salmon station mm. and homemade sorbets are available too. Wonderful. In all, it's utterly delightful and you can either pay 165 dirhams per person for the regular afternoon tea, or you can upgrade to the grand afternoon tea package for 225 dirhams. You'll find this available every day of the week in Al Habtur city. And the winner of the best afternoon tea in Dubai this year is Schwa Patisserie and Restaurant Par Pierre Gonier. Good pronunciation. Thank you. Mm. Mind my French. 
This afternoon tea from a Michelin star chef, no less, comes in at a remarkably low key setting over at Dubai Festival City. If you're looking for recommendations, then you absolutely have to try the petty cheese and truffle toasties. They are exquisite. Mm. Meanwhile, for a classic afternoon tea treat, get your hands on the colorful, light, and sweet macaroons. And it's really wallet friendly as well because it will set you back just 100 dirhams per person or 150 for two. That's economic. Very economic. Mm. It's available every single day from 2.30 p.m. until 6 p.m. at the Intercontinental Dubai Festival City. So, that's it. Those are the 10 best afternoon teas in the city, according to the Time Out Dubai Restaurant Awards 2019. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos from Time Out GCC, where we've got loads more just like this and monthly giveaways offering you the chance to win a luxury staycation. How about that? See you next time. See you later.